Hey, welcome to the No Code MBA. In this course, you're gonna learn how to build a clone of Product Hunt using Webflow, and we're gonna integrate it with JetBoost and MemberStack and discuss. Um, JetBoost is gonna be used for the upvoting capabilities, MemberStack for the login, and discuss for the commenting. So just to give you a quick demo of what you're gonna be building is you're gonna have a homepage with um, upvoting capability. And then if you click in to a specific product, you're gonna have a product page uh, similar to Product Hunt where users can upvote, um, go and browse other websites and also click through to related products, uh, watch a video for the product, um, and also um, have a commenting ability that is unique to each specific product. So if we click through to different products, you can see that each one has its own information, its own commenting section, and its own upvoting. Um, there's also a posting ability, um, which is uh, connected to Airtable. Um, and we've built a workflow uh, with this submission process. So whenever any, anyone submits a product on the site, it's gonna go into your Airtable. Um, you'll have an approval process in Airtable where once you approve it, um, it's connected to Zapier and Zapier will automatically publish that product onto your Webflow site. So there's a whole workflow, approval workflow built out uh, between Airtable and Zapier. With MemberStack, so if a user goes in to upvote a product and they're not logged in, it'll prompt them to create an account. So I'm gonna go ahead and create an account here. So you can go ahead and sign up. It's a free sign up. And once you're logged in, um, now you'll be able to upvote. So if I go ahead and I um, upvote this product to eight and then I click in, you can see now it's at eight and you can also see that now I've upvoted it. I can also click again to um, remove my upvote. Um, so that's a good overview of the product that you're going to build. Uh, one other thing that you're gonna have is a my upvote section. Um, where you can see what you've upvoted. So let me go ahead and upvote a product. Um, I'll upvote a few here. These are also going to be shown in um, the order of the most upvotes. And now I'll go to my upvotes and you can see three upvotes are now showing. So this is a good overview of what you're going to be building. We're gonna go step by step through the process from the very beginning um, all the way through the finished product. And this is also a bit more of an intermediate course so if you have no experience with Webflow before, I would recommend doing one of um, our more beginner courses, such as how to build a blog or how to build a landing page, get some familiarity with Webflow, or go to Webflow University uh, to use some of Webflow's own resources uh, to learn the basics of Webflow.